Welcome to the Big Game Record series, where we bring you the best hunting stories from the North Island Red Deer Herds. Proudly sponsored by Glacier Rifle Company, discover the precision and innovation behind every shot. Explore more with GRC. Philip S. Jennings, Mamaku Plateau, Rotorua 1970, 10 by 8, lengths of 37 and 4 by 37, spread of 31 and 2, span of 22 and 6, beams of 5 and 5 by 6, coronets of both 8 and 6, brow tines of 10 and 4 by 11 and 4, bays of 13 by 10 and 6, trays of 13 and 3 by 15 and 1. Now where the action happens. Inner royals 9 and 3 by 9. Outer royals 11 and 4 by 11 and 6. Back tine 16 and 1 by 15 and 6. Outer off the back tine 5 and 6 by 5 and 4. Left side has a second outer off the back tine of 2 and 4. A third outer off the back tine of 2 and 4. And both sides have a fourth outer off the back tine. On the left of 4 inches and the right of 5 and 5. Scoring 8 there. The total is 317 and a half. The stag was located in a strip of native bush about 5 to 6 kilometres west of the settlement of Mamaku. He was accompanied by 5 or 6 hinds and was roaring on a regular basis. Jennings was out pig hunting at the time and his dogs had taken off in search of the scent of wild pigs. The stag was heard to roar so Jennings decided to stalk him while his dogs were absent as he realised they could startle the stag and drive him off. Jennings approached to where he thought the stag was located and began to answer his roars, an action that immediately produced results, the stag coming towards him in investigation of this interloper, which had the audacity to venture onto his rutting ground. The hunter, on the other hand, decided to withhold his replies for fear of frightening the stag off and so losing him. So instead, he took to breaking sticks, an action that provoked successful... I proved successful, the stag moving right up to where Jennings was patiently waiting, and a shot through the neck concluded the saga. It has been suggested that those stags on the Mamaku were extremely aggressive and that they could be drawn in by anything sounding like a roar or the sound of an approaching challenger. <laughs> Worked in his favour there for Philip Jennings. We're into the penultimate head. Paul A. Ernest. Utahina Stream, Mamaku Plateau again, Rotorua 1980. Before we finish with Stuart Hamlet, Utahini Stream again, Mamaku Plateau, Rotorua 1982. So join us there for Paul um, on the Stag World podcast as we round out the Rotorua herd with those last two. Cheers. This is the New Zealand Big Game Record Series Volume 5, The Red Deer Part 1. Written and compiled for the New Zealand Deer Stalkers Association, incorporated by D. Bruce Banwell. With permission from the publisher by Halcyon Press, a division of Halcyon Publishing Limited, PO Box 360 Auckland, 1140 New Zealand. The book itself printed by Prolong Press Limited China. The copyright is D. Bruce Banwell, 2009, first published 2009, all rights reserved. <laughs>